Hello and welcome back to Cave Creepers. This is Mordalac. Uh, when we last left off, we had just got in our cow automatic cow cooker slash farm made and built, but we couldn't find any cows, and so we had run around and killed all of uh, the passive mobs there in the area, trying to help the cows spawn. Uh, I haven't checked yet. This is the first time I'm playing since the last episode. Doesn't look like anything's really respawned. So it may take time. What is that? Is that, is that still a sheep over there? Yeah. But you know what? I thought that... Another thought occurred to me. We... We did find some chests. Um, when we found a, a couple of cave, spawn, cave spider spawners. And I wondered if we had found a saddle, because there were those ca horses over there. We did find a saddle. Huh. You know what? Let's go check this out. Um, let's clean, a clean out our inventory real quick. Um, don't need you. Don't need you. Don't need you. Don't need you. Well, we need our furnaces. Put extra food in here. Are these? Those are raw. So we should probably start these cooking before we go. We'll take this with us. We can finish those. Take the cooked pork chop with us. Ah, uh, well, you know, we'll leave that here. Oh, we do need a new sword, don't we? We don't need a button. We don't need the string. We don't need the arrows. And... Yeah, I think that's probably pretty good. So let's put this stuff starting to cook. Uh. To finish off the cow cooker. Which we don't have. Oh, there's a lot. There's all the cooked mud in. But that's probably too much to take with us. I know our luck. I might just lose it, and I'd rather not do that. So let's take half of it with us. Take the saddle. Um, wait for this to finish cooking. There's one. Let's replace a few blocks over here with glass while we're waiting. Somehow this is going to mess it up, and uh, we'll have to rebuild it. But that's just what happens sometimes. But I just think this will look much nicer if we can see through it. Oh, wrong one. It's been a long day. All right, and then this one, this one, this one. And this one, grab those. Can we do these two bottom ones? I don't see any reason why not, right? Okay. All right, and those have to be that way, and those have to be that way, and that looks pretty good. That'll look pretty nice. Okay, now we probably definitely have enough iron by now. Let's stop the rest from cooking. Oh, too late. No problem. Make our little, oh wait, that's not right. Making a sword, not an axe. Take that, take that. Okay, put the rest of the glass away. I take the wood with us. Take the cloth. Let me take dirt. All right. Okay. Let's go try this saddle thing. I think what it is is you have to have an empty hand, right? I actually have never ridden a horse before. Um, so this should be fun. I think you have to try to start riding them with an empty hand, and then. Eventually, you keep trying, and eventually they like you, and they become tamed, and then you can put a saddle on them. And you also can't tell how good they are until they're tamed. But can you remove a saddle from a horse? At once you... Uh, which horse do we want? You know what? We'll take the one that doesn't have the dots. Uh, it doesn't have the spots. So, empty hand. Let's give it a shot. 
It is not. Ooh, sorry, wrong hand, buddy. Ooh, sorry, I meant to not do that. Here we go. Oh, he didn't like me. Come on. Good horse. Good horse. Aw, oh, come on, little buddy. We can be friends. We can be friends. Look at us go. Look at us go. Oh, so close. We're going to be best friends, guy. We're going to be best friends. Yay. Do we got it? Do we got it? Oh, no. So close. <clears throat> Who's more determined, him or I? Oh no! Wah, he's a he's a he's stubborn. But we'll make friends yet. I refuse to not be friends with you. No, I'm not giving up. Ooh, that was a quick one. I actually have no idea how long this can take. I have, ooh, ah, there we go. So, what, you put a saddle on? Great. Oh, I did know that if you have more than one row of hearts, that that's a good sign. And... I can't tell if he's very fast. I don't think he doesn't feel very fast. But you know what? I'm not going to complain. Okay. So, we didn't need to leave this area for quite a while, and hopefully that stuff respawns. Uh, we have enough food. So maybe we can... What do we have with us? We have everything we need. We have some coal, some sticks, some wood. Alright. We could probably try... Starting to make our cave spider... Spawner trap, our XP thing. Our XP generator. Um, I don't think it's going to be our long-term solution. I really, really don't. Um, but I figured we could try it. We could see what kind of see what kind of enchantments we can get real quick. Yeah. So we'll go down there. We'll block off the area. All right. So dismount. Oh wait. Um, well, if I do that, am I going to have enough stuff? Okay. Yes, we definitely need to go back to town. I'm sorry. I forgot. I want to make some buckets and bring some water in so I can make a... So I can make a jump. Just a a one, uh, one block drop all the way down. Put a couple buckets of water at the bottom so we land in some deep water. And that way, getting in and out will be really fast. And then we can build the ladder... So it'll take a few, it'll take a few minutes to actually fix the hole there, but I think it'll be worth it in the long term. Oh, good jump horse! All right, feel free to graze right here. I'll be right back, little buddy. Um, I guess we have to smelt some more. I guess this is the bad thing about waiting to smelt. Um, you can break this into three, right? Into four. That's fine. Nine's probably good enough. And the second one, yes. Alright, so let's put all our extra food in here. Alright, so we definitely have a lot of food. I mean, we'll be fine no matter what. So let's leave that. Let's leave that. I'll start with the baked potatoes just so we can save inventory space. All the single stuff, we'll get rid of that. First, um... Okay, well that's doing that. We can quickly make two buckets. There we go. We have enough for two buckets. Is it really almost night time again? Okay, bucket. Bucket. I'm not quite sure I'll need a bed on this trip, but we're gonna have to do this. Um, and that's good enough, I think. That gives us enough for a couple, an extra axe or so. Okay. Oh, here's a good question. From a horse, can I open a gate? Yes. You know what? 
Then... Just because I don't want my horse to die. Um, first. Come here, Mr. Sun. Have to make ourselves a walk clock, I think. This is a very nice night out. All right. Hopefully that's enough time. There we go. Okay, on our way, yet again. Oh, horses actually can jump over it, right? If they have a high enough jump. Okay. Off we go. Oh, I see. If you hold, you can get a bigger jump. I see. I didn't know that. All right, Mr. Horse. If you could stay right here, that'd be awesome. All right. So we definitely know that if we go straight down, there's no lava because we dug this out. So let's live on the edge. Let's make sure we don't go too far. Okay, we definitely still have to go more. Oh! Well, that was not very good. We don't want it to be right there. We want it to be right next to it. So we kind of want the drop to be here. Which is not good, because we just ruined our staircase up. Alright, so we want this to be right here. No, we don't. Um, let's think about this. Is this way blocked off? Mm. Alright, well, it's for now, let's block this area off. Where's our dirt? Only because it's really low, it's really quick to break later. Okay, so we have this kind of safe. You know what? Let's make our exit out after we um, after we open this area up because we don't want to put it right inside our build area so one of the first things we want to do is this we want to stand here and f where's the f that they said to look for Let me see, uh, it must have changed in this version compared to other versions. So let me try to read all these settings and try to see what they were saying. There's something about an F and the sides when you point it in two directions. When it said uh, 1 and 2, those sides would be the four sides big. But we don't know that, do we? Interesting. Uh, I don't see it anywhere. Maybe they removed it. Okay. Well, we will make it eight by eight around here no matter what. So let's just start with that, okay. So we know we need to make this bigger. So we're definitely gonna need an ax. So let's grab an ax, let's get rid of all this wood. Start, we'll start with that. We may have to go hunting for more supplies later on, but that's something we can deal with in a little bit. Okay, axe. Let's get rid of this wood. Which we can use for other things later. Okay. Let's kind of block this off up here so nothing comes up. And then we can block, build our room. Okay. Nothing behind here, right? Except our own stuff. Okay. So you want it to be... Well, things can spawn two blocks above and then three down. Uh, no, so two above, two down. Including the block that this is actually on. And then you want two for water below it. 
So yes, we have to make this much bigger than it is. But let's just square this room off real quick. So this will be one, one, two, three, four. Okay, so we'll take this out here. And if nothing else, this gets us a bunch of materials to build a better monster generator. Alright, and we want it to be, we said two above. So that's actually to right here. So this actually we don't need. Um, I'm not actually too concerned about how it actually looks. Uh, we'll use whatever blocks we have available. Um, probably want to keep most of the cobblestone. I like to actually build with cobblestone, so I want to keep as much of that as I can. Alright, so how far back do we want to go? So we want to go one, two, three. So this wall has to go. Put ourselves a torch there so we know that's the wall we like. What's over there? Okay, so it's. I don't, didn't quite remember this area. I'll make sure that's not like another spawner area here. Okay, let's block that up. And let's break all this down. Do I still have that shovel on me? No, right. We use. But you know what? We make a quick wood one. Make this job as fast as possible. Oh no! Grab that wood and these fences. We're gonna block off this wall anyway. No reason to waste this wonderful wood. Okay, that's good, that's good. Um, all right, so we can finish this wall with wood. I'm mean, sorry, with dirt. All right, so this has to go over how far? I mean, I suppose I could leave the upper staircase there and we could use that. So it's one, three, and four, and then this way. Put a torch here. Take all this out. Ooh, there's our chest. Or sorry, our working bench. We'll just leave it there for the moment. No reason to move it. Lost our torch. Sorry about that. Okay, we should probably block all that up. We don't want to leave that open for too long. All sorts of nasty stuff will come along and join us. What we're looking for. All right, is that still right? Make sure we did that right. So it's four that way. How many this way? One, two, three, four. So that's actually the, this wall. So we take out this corner here. We still have to go down, but we're just figuring out the upper area first. All right, so it can be two below it, but I also want two levels of water. Well, there's actually like one level of water, but it descends from an upper level to a lower level. It cascades down. So we actually want four levels below. And then unlike the last time, let me add this while I have something to stand on. Okay. 
grab all this wonderful cobblestone, take this out. Okay, and we will find our staircase after we know that. I'm just gonna, you know what, we'll leave that open for now so we know how to get to it. Well, maybe we'll make a passageway that way to get um, and around. Our kill zone should be over here. Um, or we could put the, we could put the, our, our trap the area this direction and then make a passage going up to this. Uh, yeah, I think that should work, right? Because they can't spawn up there. They can only spawn two up. So I'm just as afraid of leaving an empty area. All right, so let's, so we actually need to fill in some of this. Let me just grab this coal. Especially since we have a villager who wants to take as much as they can from us. But we should get the general shape of it done. Today, I hope. Oh no. Did we bring an extra? Oh no, we didn't. This is horrible. Bad planning. Okay, let's look around. Uh, any iron nearby? No. Okay. Well, you know, we can make a... We can just focus on the task at hand and not worry about uh, coal. So we can come here. I actually don't know if this is a good idea. This might actually add a lot of time to our work here. Okay. But we do need to break this. Put that, I think, here. Block this up. Ugh. That was terrible. Okay, let's block this up. Right, and then also everything this way. Right, so that's four over. Yes. Let's get rid of this. Let's grab this torch. Well, actually, let's leave the torch there in case anything spawns back there. Uh, no choice but to use cobblestone, huh? Oh, well, well, we do what we can. Okay, all right, that's looking not quite beautiful, but functional. All right, so, oh yeah, so now we have to go down. So we need to go down. We're on this level now, so we have to go down one, two, three, four. Okay, um, I think I remember that you can, well, well, the good news is we found an emerald. The bad news is I don't think we can get it with a stone pickaxe, so we may have to come in later and grab that. But if I recall correctly, what we want to do is this. Is this right behind me? Yes. We want to go this way. We'll light it up for now. And so they spawn within, what, 16 blocks of it? But we want to be at 14 blocks away. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 
the idea is, is that only so many can spawn within a certain proximity around this. We want to make sure that they all come out and they build up outside there. Only six can spawn right in the area. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. All right, so this is our spot that we're going to use. So we'll make our little room up above here. Okay. But what that means is, I think we do this. That this goes here, that goes there, and we actually fill all this in, right? Because this is two below, right? So I actually did some extra excavating that I did not need to do. Actually, you know what? I should use the white stuff. The diorite. I'm sorry I picked you up. I'm sorry I wasted time. All right, and then it would actually be from here, 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 and then all this would come out. So you come with me, you come with me, you, you. I'll come, right? And what we want to do is fill this in. And I completely forgot to get water when I was up above, right? Because we're going to put water sources here, and here, and here, and there. Um, and that'll force all of them to come this way, right? And so they're going to come down here. Um, we may have to make this one tall so that they uh, cannot jump and stick to the walls. Um, but this is our important spot, so I'm going to put a torch right here so we know that this is our spot. Let's build us a little room out here. And it's, we have to attach this room to our staircase, which is in line with it. So we're just going to go up and over to our staircase, and that's how we're going to get back out. Um, make like a So let's make ourselves a little room here. It doesn't have to be very big. Uh, do we want to leave that there? I think we might want to leave that there. Ideally, you'd also put like an enchanting table right here. But I guess you could just come down here and just grab like, you know, like 36 levels or something. So, we should probably bring them up what? We should probably bring them up. Ooh, so we should probably, we have to keep this like this. Like to here, will that work? Sorry, need to make a bigger roof. Put some light here. All right, so I think that's the basic shape of our trap. We just have to attach this to our staircase, fill it with water. They should rise up and come up here. Um, probably should keep this open for now so I can get up and down I can finish we can fill it in at the very last moment because once we do that all these guys are gonna start coming after us so we get the basic shape this is kind of what we're doing um, we can pick up here next time and then finish it up uh, also should probably go back and grab a, some iron pickaxe we have to come back in here again what will we do we will put I have to really think about this. I'm not sure of the mechanics, but we put this here and then remove that, right? And then we would build, we'd fill this in here, all the way up to here, and then the spires are gonna come and they're gonna climb up and when they see me, or us, and then we'll just be able to hit them with our sword. Um, 
we can do if we can find some sticky um, some slimes we make a sticky piston that we can crush them with to reduce them to one hip one health but I don't plan we don't plan on using this long term this is only like a short term solution because we'll be able to make much faster XP um, generators so this is just to get us going and as a little bit of practice so okay I will log off here we can pick up here next time so thank you very much for watching I appreciate it if you like please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you next time okay